Now, we are 70 days into President Biden's 100-day promise to get vaccines out to all Americans. But being eligible and finding a vaccine are two very different stories. Florida's biggest shipment of vaccines is heading this way next week, just in time for opening up. And now there's even more places that are giving out shots. 10 Investigates' Jennifer Titus explains all of that in tonight's episode of Vaccinated. Like these are the Pfizer. Phyllis Rader has been waiting a long time for these. The J and J in a bag. She is a pharmacist at Main Street Pharmacy in Safety Harbor. Johnson and Johnson are in the boxes. She says they are excited to finally be able to vaccinate their customers with the COVID-19 vaccine. Ever since we got it, like our phone has not stopped ringing. Our, I, I had to hire some extra help. She says she's perfectly fine with that if it means they are helping to get shots in arms. We're getting as many as we uh, can. We've done over 500 by now in the last like three weeks, um, but there's still a great need. There's Good. still a great need and they're opening it up. On Monday, eligibility opens for those 18 and up wanting Moderna or Johnson & Johnson. Those 16 and up can get the Pfizer vaccine. We will, by my 100th day in office, have administered 200 million shots. This comes on top of the president's latest goal of 200 million shots in 100 days. So far, the country has administered 136.1 million shots since he made that promise. That's 68% of his goal with 30 days left to get there. Florida has given 8.5 million shots. 16.9% of the state's residents have been fully vaccinated at this point. We, it's more personable here and people really like it's a little it's a little bit more homey. Phyllis hopes when eligibility expands Monday, those wanting an appointment will be able to find one. Get a little bit more attention or, you know, we do try to um, give them a little bit more attention than you might get somewhere else. So we talked about that vaccine shipment right before that piece. We're going to get around 800,000 first doses, which should hopefully help open up more appointments as well. So when can you book an appointment? Let's take a deeper dive into some of that. Some places like Pinellas County and Publix are already letting 18 year olds register. Pasco and Hernando counties are going to open registration on Sunday. Many places want you to pre register before you actually book. Remember the FEMA site that's walk up. But if to find out how you can register for your appointment, we've got everything you need to know at 10tampabay.com.